you know, it's all worthless. Every bit of it. Every bit of it is worthless. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. I can't do a cool stack like Yankee does on his channel. <laughs> That's cool. He's a really smart guy, but every time you buy gold or silver, you get a little bit smarter. <laughs> it's, it's a documented fact. How you doing, buddy? Oh, hi. I'm fine. Are you doing well? Did you have a nice Christmas? I had a great Christmas. All right. I'm here also with, what's your name? Ken. Ken? Yes. And you don't mind me having you on camera? Yeah, I love it. <laughs> oh, man. What brought you into Tim's? Uh, you did. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh. No, I, I, I wouldn't have known about Tim if it were, if it were not for you. What did you, know? you, you want to do here in the shop? Uh, fix my plumbing today. <laughs> fix your, Tim, fix you my plumbing. plumbing? It's a kind of a... A, a difficult transition between silver and gold and plumbing, yeah. <laughs> but we do it all the time. I'm trading silver for copper. <laughs> you see, yeah, that's At least great. it's in the metal field, right? <laughs> great. So you brought in some of this stuff, right? Yeah. Wow, what is that? Uh, these are Philharmonics, and these are the 2020 Maple Leafs. They come in a little capsule, though. It keeps oh, them beautiful. Yeah, they are nice. They're new. Yeah, they right? are beautiful, huh? Very cool. So you're, yeah. you're selling these. Yeah, unfortunately. Yeah. Unfortunately. That's not your your desire, but it's your opportunity, yeah. right? Well, that, that's the whole purpose of silver, silver stacking, you know, instead of keeping it in the bank. I keep it close. And I can't fit all that in my pocket, but uh, <laughs> it's safe anyway. <laughs> that's great. So you gave him a good deal? No, oh, excellent. Not deal. as good as he would have gotten yesterday, unfortunately. I bought a lot of stuff yesterday. And he's yeah. selling today. So it's, yeah. it's, it's not working well for both of us. Well, you know what happened? Biden went on vacation. Someone's got to pay for it. Uh, <laughs> I couldn't help but put true. that in there. No, you, 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 perfect, <laughs> perfect segue. I'm going to ask yeah. you, Tim, about this $1.7 trillion omnibus oh, bill, man. What the heck? Oh, my goodness. You're trying to upset me early in the morning again. Yeah. I, I, well, I brought you coffee. Uh, yeah. Yes, I haven't had it. Though. <laughs> oh, that's right. You're not, we're going to speak uh, to an uncaffeinated is, Tim right now. You know, right. I'd love to see the list. I have a, a bunch of lists I'd like to see. One is the liars list, the uh, 51 uh, intelligence uh, agents who said that there is nothing to see about uh, uh Hunter Biden's laptop because it was all Russian disinformation. Okay? Mm -hmm. That list I want to see. But the list of the 7,000 pet projects that are in this bill, um, that's just disgraceful. It's really disgraceful. You have a problem with uh, giving millions of dollars to, to have a the study the fight club of hamsters or you know the the, the, uh, the way that, kids that, relate to their pets or that, that whether maybe, or not Marvel. Uh, that, Thanos could literally snap his fingers with a metal gauntlet. Do you have a problem with those, Tim? <laughs> They're probably better projects than some of the other stuff I've heard about. <laughs> you know, it's all worthless. Every bit of it. Every bit of it is worthless. And um, these people should be ashamed of themselves. They should be impeached. Anybody who votes for something like that should be thrown out of office. I mean, the, we need to start distributing lists of the people who vote like this every time just because they're told to. Like our reps here we have in New Hampshire. Uh, they're useless if they're going to vote for these projects. We had 18 Republicans sign on to this monstrosity. Uh, I Apparently they're all retiring. Good riddance. There's a handful of them that did. Designed off on it, correct? They did. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Mrs. Yankee was saying, this is immoral. It is immoral. And there's a lot about it that's immoral, and they, um, these people have no understanding of how hard the people who are working work for that money that they just thrown away. Mm -hmm. uh, and don't forget the, the the latest bonus to Zelensky and the most corrupt government in the history of Europe. It, it's really amazing. Uh, plus know, and the, then and then I saw another stat that just galled me. It said that 63 percent of Americans. Would uh, would like the idea of another federal stimulus check? They can't pay for things because of inflation. So what they're asking for is us to print more currency, create more inflation, and hand out that that wow. stimulus. It's a never-ending doom cycle. Yeah, you're making everybody poor. 
That's, we are. That, that's we are. Making, that's the key to that, mm. that scheme. Yep. Make everybody poor. You know, Rand Paul has been the one uh, lone voice in Congress calling out the fiscal irresponsibility, Tim. Well, <clears throat> uh, according to the ads that Maggie Hassan ran, uh, she brought fiscal responsibility to the United States Congress. I, I heard it was in, in her ads. <laughs> it must be true then. <laughs> must be true. Yeah. yeah. So this is Ken a, a portion of your stack that you're selling today? A very small portion. <laughs> very very nice. small portion. Good for yeah. you. Yeah. Good for no, you. I like it. My dad got me into it. Well, I got my grandson into it now too. Wow. So Phillies and maples. What's in this? What's in that? Uh, Eagles. 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 First, I started just to get the weight. Then I went after the different things, interesting things. Like I like these, the uh, the Canadian Wildlife series. Oh, nice! Those are really yeah. nice. They come different sizes, ounce and a half, ounce and a quarter, which is pretty cool. I like the Canadian mint. I prefer their coins for some reason. I don't know. I just oh, they have a great like variety. Them. Yeah, yeah, they do have a good variety. So, so you're selling these. You're gonna keep the rest. Yep. And. Uh, you gonna buy some of it back? Like I told him, I'll tell you, I gotta have to replace it in a month. <laughs> Thanks, brother. Take care. Very man. nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I knew you were struggling at one point to get some of the uh, some five of ounce bars. Are five tough. ounce. Five yeah. ounce. Yeah, they're really tough, and the price is going up on them too. Oh, shrink wrapped. Okay. Yeah. Wow, those are the IGRs, right? Yeah. Italy. No, I, IGR is. Istanbul, Istanbul Gold Refinery. Yeah. Turkey. Yep. Turkey. I knew that. That's why I said... I knew you knew that. Italy. Yeah. <laughs> a, a you never let me get away with a mistake. Not while I'm on camera, dude. <laughs> now, but you edit mine out, don't you? You never make any mistakes. What are you talking about? <laughs> what do you think of the coffee? Usually when I get it from Dunkin' Donuts, that's really good. That's good coffee. Wow. Did you... Hear anything about the, what the, is going on with the post office? The reason why I buy from SD Bullion is because they're the top of the line. Service is unbelievable. The prices can't be beat. I uh, love doing business with them. They have the best prices. I trust them. They're extremely easy to purchase through. They have great prices and great products. Uh, integrity and fast shipping. Just a quality organization. A good friend of mine, Yankee Stacking, is the reason why I shop there. Uh, I went to a certain post office. I don't want to bash anybody. Um, on Friday, and the I guess the new clerk didn't know what registered mail was all about. So I decided I'll, I'll go to the other post office. Mm -hmm. Well, um, I went there on Saturday and they were closed. You know, and I got there long before closing time, but they were closed. And so, um, oh, I can just on this stuff on Monday. Oh no, Monday they were closed. So I go to the main post office. And it said from uh, December 27th to the 31st, we'll be closing at 4.30. So all these packages are now today, they're all, all, a week old. Because you because can't get them shipped so out. So I'm going to, I can't go back there. I can't close it four to go up to the post office. So I'm going to try Bedford again. It's almost like you need an assistant to do your uh, uh, mail. Running around? Yeah, yeah. you're running around. Yeah. Would you like to do that? Would you like to take all my packages to the post office? Uh, There's no money in it. It doesn't matter. I'll help you out, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> What's that bar way over there? That's a kilo bar. Same. I just don't put them on the middle no, of the glass. No, that's smart. That's, that's a, a unique Scottsdale stacker, yeah. right? How much are a kilo bar? Um, they just, I'm selling right now at 8.30, 830. Okay? and that's not a lot of money. Um, let me see, because they're, 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 right now they're less than a 100 ounce bar. Yeah. Man, feel, feel that. That is... So you could stack them all? Yeah. Where is Scottsdale located? Probably in Arizona. Arizona. Scottsdale, Arizona. I could have said Italy. <laughs> yes, Scottsdale, <laughs> Italy. That's quite a resort town in Italy. 
I don't think Italy makes any bullion coins, do they? Um, yeah, they do. <laughs> Actually, most of what we've been getting has been coming from Italy. Really? It's yes. Ital Preziosi. I don't know where the other one is, but there's yeah. there's another one that uh, one of my customers um, is coming in probably today. And he asked specifically about those. I said, I wish I could tell you I have some coming in, but we don't know where they're coming from. I'll well, have the IGR has been selling. Very well. Yeah, I have I have to ship out uh, uh, 39 of them. Okay. Wow. To one person? One person, yeah. Oh, Wow. And it's um, that's a <clears throat> but it's the packaging we're trying to figure out right now. It's a big <laughs> ticket item. That's, that's a big. lot of cash. It is a lot of cash. So you're gonna pick those up? Yep. I'm debating whether to get another five ounce bar because I did get a bonus from work. Good for you. I'm with another stacker here. What's your first name? Daniel. Daniel. Good to meet you. Uh, uh what brings you into uh, Tim's shop? Your channel. And. <laughs> I just found out about you like uh, the beginning of December. You popped up on my uh, YouTube algorithm. So then uh, I saw you guys were local. So now every week I come in and try and pick up like 100 bucks worth of silver. Every week? Yeah. Uh, Steadily $100. So you're dollar cost averaging. Yep. Every week. You yep. Just yep. Doing it the Yankee way. Pick up a couple <laughs> rounds a week. That's fantastic. Yeah. Uh, and uh, you, you mentioned your wife was outside? Yeah. She's actually in the car right there with my daughter. She's uh, napping in the car. Yeah, she's actually it's, been looking online to get me a, uh, a treasure chest or something to keep all the silver in. Oh, that's wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> so, pretty cool. Cool. What do you like to... Uh, hey, what's going on, man? Do you live here now? <laughs> yeah, every week we come. <laughs> <laughs> what do you like to pick up? Um, Just silver rounds, whatever. He, uh, Tim always has different stuff. So uh, last week I got a couple of the scorpions. The week before that I got the leopards. Um, before that, I got a Britannia, a Maple, and then a Liberty and an Eagle. Wow, you're just, just collecting all the different styles. Yeah, right so I think I'm a little over 60 ounces right now. 60? Yeah, because I started with a kilo when I first... I went on, I saw, um, what was that? I think ST Bullion popped up on one of your ads. Yeah. So then that was the you first thing I ordered, okay. and then I started from there. Very good. Seven ground rounds. How long have you been stacking for? Well, if you count when I was a kid riding my bicycle to the bank to do some coin roll hunting and my grandfather getting me into it, I would say since the 80s, my dad and I would, would go and, and buy silver dimes and silver quarters. How many ounces of silver are you up to? Uh, well, it's, it's thousands. Wow, that's crazy. Yeah, I think my first goal was to try and get to a thousand. Good. Yeah. Yeah, it takes time. You know, yeah. I'm 56 years old. Okay? Yeah. So I'm an old guy. Yeah. You're a young guy. You're a young guy. <laughs> well, I'm so glad you came in here uh, for just from Tim. That's awesome. I'm glad you're stacking. Yeah. Smart move. Yeah. Oh, one thing my wife noticed about you is you always have a gold ring and a silver ring on. So then um, yeah. she wanted me to get her a gold ring, too. <laughs> it's a really smart guy, but every time you buy gold or silver, you get a little bit smarter. <laughs> it's a documented fact. So, you asked me about CBDCs? Yeah. For sympathy. That right there at a certain point people have to think will be a thing of the past in you know, your lifetime. Yeah, See definitely. Okay. You'll we'll be able to go yeah, into yeah. a, you know, a, a right coin right shop right. dealer like Tim's and pull out 20s and, and buy some silver and gold. Yeah. yeah. It's going to be very challenging. So it's a very in interesting lifetime. little bit. Yeah, well, I feel like our generation, too, like, no one carried cash. Like, I go out of my way to get cash to go buy bullion. Like, everything, like, when me and my friends go out, we use, like, Cash App, Venmo. We're already... Absolutely. All based on Most like digital money, anyway. So, money. but, people are buying but it what sketches me out is when you so see how they can like uh, put expirations on money. They can approve yeah. what you can and can't do with money they give you. So yeah. that's but like you sketchy. Really that that yeah. So that's why I'm here. <laughs> well, you in terms of your generation. Yeah, I think the majority will have no problem with it at all. Would have no problem. Yeah. With you. Somebody just came in and unloaded a bunch of 90%. I see quarters. So you can't get mad at me about the quarters anymore, right? Well, I thought you were going to take them with you. No. Uh, <laughs> dimes. Dimes, too. Yes. Well, those are the ones that I'm interested in, in getting. So. Oh, great. Oh, come on. So, <laughs> we could uh, 
get some of the dimes. But before I do that, we've got some people that have some other... Bi- Wait a minute, you just put them away? Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, I put them where I can trip over them. Well, I, I don't want to show these people's faces, but uh, you have been coming into Tim's for a bit. Is that true? Yeah, I think I've been in it quite yeah. a few times. And uh, I'm sorry, I have to see this. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Wow, is that a gold AR? It is. Uh, I had a pewter pin that I, I had when I get back from uh, I got back from Iraq. My wife had taken the pin to one of the little uh, Cambodian shops in Lowell jewelry shop. Yeah, they made a casting of it and then they cast it in eighteen for me. How long did it take, months. baby? Three months. About three months. The and they broke the mold, so it's the only tours? one that's ever going to be made. Let's wow. make another one. How many tours did you do? I, I did one, which was enough. Yeah, I got thank you so much for your tours. Thank you. Wow, I love, I really do love that. Why don't you step up and get something here? Okay. So, Tim, uh, I don't know what you're doing for uh, ten ounce bars. You have quite a few of them. Uh, I don't. Oh. Um, in fact, I've got a ton on order. Okay. Um, let me see if there's any bars. shipping memo now. I have lots of kilos. Okay. They don't. They don't last long in here. No, they don't. I've stacked eagles. I've stacked rounds. I've you know all kinds of sovereign silver and uh, right now I think I'm just going to focus on the ten bars just because a lot more silver, less premium. Yeah, <clears throat> makes sense. Makes so. sense. What does your wife like? Gold or silver? My wife is the gold gold bug. <laughs> I'm a little stash at home. It's, it's much smaller. I, but I, I love the necklace. I won't show it, but there's a beautiful. Oh, you can neck- show it. Can I? Yeah. 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 There's this A. All the way gold. It's me. Gorgeous necklace. Thank you. I love the palm. Like I said earlier, though, we appreciate you. We wouldn't mm-hmm. have found Tim's shop if it wasn't for stumbling on your channel, and now we're regulars, so thank yeah. you. I appreciate that very much, too. Don't know when those 10-ounce bars are coming in. They're, they're ordered. He, he, um, they haven't applied a shipping date to them yet, but I, I think the, they'll do that probably tomorrow. So um, what do you have on, like on here? I think she wants, you said gold. Yeah. Were you looking for one ounce? Yeah. Buffalo. Maybe a yeah. buffalo? I do have a couple of 10 ounce bars. I mean, how many were you looking for? We'll take them all if you can. Uh, let me see if I have one more. You have the Germania bar that is a little more expensive. Germania. Yeah, the Germania mint puts out some really pretty stuff. I love these chunky bars. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty. Yeah. I, I got lay my bone the, uh, yeah, I got a silver the decision by committee. The, uh, gold, it is. Um, the buffalo it is. Mm-hmm. 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 Oh yeah, there's nothing like holding gold, is there? Right. <laughs> so you're gonna go with the Germania, this one, the one kilo, and the gold. Wow. Uh, if I have money, I will buy them all. Okay. Uh, I can't do a cool stack like Yankee does on his channel. Oh, That's cool. All right, Tim. Okay. Until next time. Wait, 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 wait. You need to find me the liars oh, list. The liars yes. list. All right. That's the 51 intelligence officials who claimed that the Hunter Biden story was Russian propaganda, Russian disinformation. I want to see who else we can't trust in this business, in this administration. Thanks a lot. Appreciate you. Thank you.